All this green in my pockets, you can call it turtle power. What's poppin' YouTube, it's FSU Retail, and today I come at you with a pretty epic Pokemon Go video. Today I have an updated version of the Pokemon Go hack we've all been waiting for. Now in the past few days, there's, there's been a few new Pokemon Go hacks, right? I did a video on one of them yesterday, and it worked for a lot of people, but for some people it didn't work, and it was like, it was prompting them to update and stuff, it was pretty weird. So today I actually have a reliable Pokemon Go hack that I guarantee you will work for everyone if you follow my instructions in the video, alright? Now don't fucking, you know, not pay attention to the video and then expect it not to work, right? You gotta pay attention to my instructions on how to get the hack, which I'll show later on in this video. But I do want to mention before I get into the Pokemon Go hack that I am doing a small little giveaway today. I'm going to be giving away a $25 iTunes code and a $25 Google Play code. If you want to win, just simply like the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, be sure to do those things, and then also drop a comment. I'm going to pick a random comment that has done all three of those things to win the giveaway. So best of luck to you guys. But anyway, I'm actually using the hack right now if you couldn't fucking tell right it's pretty obvious and uh, it's pretty easy to use I've used it before this is actually the new updated tutu app hack for Pokemon Go and Tutu app, which is the application you, you're gonna use to get this hack, and I'll show you how to get that in just a minute here. But the app actually got updated and it's a lot easier to use, and it's actually in English now, so we don't have to learn fucking Chinese, so that's pretty good for a change. And uh, anyway, with this hack, you can teleport, it has the little joystick, um, and also you can, you know, run around. It's pretty easy to use. I'll show you guys how to use it in a minute here once I catch this Persian right here. So there we go, gotcha, bitch, you damn straight. And uh, let me register it to the the Pokedex here. Okay, I got a little new Pokemon, you know what I'm saying? You don't see this every day. A new Pokemon. That's the reason why I like to use hacks. Also, I do want to mention, I only recommend using hacks on a second account because, you know, of course, little disclaimer, you are at risk of getting bans, but hey, level 13. Second account's doing pretty good, if I do say so myself. Anyway, so, um, let me just give a quick little like two minute tutorial on how to use this hack and then in a few minutes I'll show you how to get this hack so stay tuned for that there's actually a version for iOS and Android I'll be showing you guys today so that's pretty hype because you know of course you know equal rights right I mean you know Android lives matter too but anyway you can spin pokey stops you can go wherever you want in the fucking world if that's not enough for you and um of course teleporting is also a big feature I like to use but just to show you guys that it does work if you're just walking around an area you teleported to for example say San Francisco, which is actually where you start out in the hack. Um, let me just show you guys that you can catch any Pokemon. Um, and now, if you are curious of how to not get soft banned, I'm going to mention that real quick after I catch this Pokemon right here. When you are teleporting, you want to make sure you return home before you catch a Pokemon. So let me go pull up another one to make sure I didn't get soft banned because the tell you got soft banned, the Pokemon will run away, just like the last one. Now, I'm pretty sure I'm not soft banned because I did the proper thing then to avoid it. So I'm pretty sure the Pokemon just actually ran away that time. So to prove it, we're going to catch the Spearow and see if I get banned right here. So three, two, one, and yep, I am not banned. So thank God. All right. So, so to avoid getting soft banned, just follow these few simple steps, right? And, uh, you know, obviously you can only get soft banned if you teleport and if you use the drive feature, don't drive, don't be that guy. Either use the walk or the run, okay? There's no need to use the drive. Anyway, we're going to return home here and go onto pokeyzz.com just to get some coordinates. This is a really good website if you're using the teleport feature. You can just find a random Pokemon that you want and then you can go ahead and snipe it. I'm going to go get this Arcanine right here so I copy the coordinates I'm gonna go back into my hack right here go to the teleport feature and I'm gonna copy and paste my coordinates right here and it's gonna take me right to the Pokemon which is pretty fucking sweet I'm not gonna lie so uh, there we go and we're gonna teleport right to the Pokemon right there but anyway I do want to mention if you are new to the channel be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on stuff like this because there's not a lot of youtubers out there that are gonna constantly update you when the brand new hacks are out and whatnot and also on Pokemon go updates I also I like to you know give my opinion on this channel if you if you're subscribed, you definitely know. I like to rant on a lot of stupid stuff Niantic does. So subscribe for that as well. You don't want to miss that. Anyway, so before you throw a Pokeball at it, don't throw a Pokeball. All right, keep that shit in your pants. Keep your balls in your pants, people. You want to hit the home button right here. So you want to tab this out and hit home. And it's going to say, beware, you might get banned. Yeah, just hit move. 
and then while you're catching the Pokemon, it's gonna basically return you home. So once again, to make sure I did it, we're, we returned home now, so now we can catch the Pokemon. So you can use the Raspberry, do whatever you want to catch it, it doesn't matter, as long as you catch the damn thing. That was a really shitty throw on my end. Okay, there we go, nice throw, you damn straight, that was a nice throw. Now we're gonna catch the Pokemon right here real quick. Hopefully it gets in the ball on the first try, or else I'm gonna be a pissed off motherfucker. Oh, okay, I thought it was gonna jump out. There we go, hey, all right, Arcanine was caught, you damn straight. All right, so uh, it's gonna register to the Pokedex. If you haven't caught it, blah, 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 you know the drill. And then once you catch the Pokemon and return home, you're gonna be like, whoa. I'm not where I was. I returned home. Yes, because you hit the return home button. So now you returned home. And uh, just just to show you guys, I did not get banned. Let me uh, let me go walk towards a Pokestop right here. And look, there's a big one that just spawned. And uh, just to show you guys, I didn't get banned. There we go. I can use the Pokestop. So anyway, that's enough rambling on my end. Let me show you guys how to get this brand new Pokemon Go hack. So stay tuned. So we're going to use the same method to get the Tutu app hack just like we've used before. Simply go to the Tutu app website right here. Tutuapp.vip is going to bring you to their site. You want to hit regular because of course we want to get the free version. But in their latest update, which is why the Tutu app was down over the weekend, they actually added a brand new free version that's in English. So props to them. We don't have to learn fucking Chinese now. We can actually navigate it and read the fucking words, which is nice. It's a nice little addition. So we're going to go ahead and install that to the home screen. Now I do want to mention there's also a VIP version right here where you can pay seven bucks to get this and uh, it's a lot easier to navigate. There's like no ads and stuff like that. But you know, uh, you know, I, I do prefer the free version because you know, time is money. I'm not going to spend my fucking time and money buying the VIP version like fuck that dude there's also an Android version if you do have an Android phone however it is Chinese only but it's easy to navigate just like this app so just follow my instructions below how to navigate it but anyway once you tap on it it's gonna prompt you to trust the developer and all you have to do is simply go into your general settings if you have an iOS device and I hit general you're gonna scroll all the way down to profile device management and then you're gonna go ahead and hit this one right here and you're gonna trust it, all right? And then it's gonna take a second, and then the app will be trusted. And by doing this, it's not gonna like hack you or anything, it just allows the app to be able to be used um, by your phone, of course. So anyway, you're gonna allow notifications if you want it, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't notify you about anything, so uh, there we go. Now there are ads in the new version, but you know, the developers have to make money somehow, right? So there we go, and then as you can see right there, look at Pokemon Go USA, hack right here basically it's that's it right the english version of the hack you want to go in and download that and uh that's the hack right there if you can't find that if you go in the search it will show up it should show up yeah just pokemon go i mean you can search and it'll bring you right to it so you can't miss it it's right there on the home screen and actually it looks pretty cool when you're downloading it, it actually shows you the percentage it's at unlike before where you were like okay is it downloading is it not downloading what's going on but as you can see it shows you it downloading within the app so once it finishes downloading it's going to start installing onto your home screen which is what you want and uh, of course we're going to go back in here it's going to install it for a second and then you're going to hit install and now it's going to install on your home screen so it's a, like an extra step you have to take into getting the hack but it, all you have to do is just pay attention and you'll be fine um, but yeah, uh, it'll pretty much start installing on your home screen in a second. Obviously, it's, it's being a little slow because my internet's, you know, internet's not doing the best today because let me just switch off Wi-Fi real quick. Actually, no, I, I trust my Wi-Fi. Let me just let me just install it real quick and uh, Donald Trump spamming my email, motherfucker. Like, I, I signed up for Donald Trump and Hillary's email and now they're both spamming me and I hate it. But anyway, I'll come back with you guys once it finally finishes downloading onto the home screen. So I just want to remind you guys, sometimes it takes a few minutes for this to basically pop up it prompts you to install it once it pops up hit install uh, it took me a few seconds there but I tried it on my other device and it took a few minutes so it may vary between like three minutes and a few seconds so just keep that in mind if it doesn't pop up right away please wait like five minutes don't go fucking keyboard warrior in the comment section below all right but we're gonna go in and open it up right here to show you guys that it does indeed work and this is the correct version I was using earlier in the video so it's gonna start loading up the game it's gonna you know tell you Niantic is Titanic right uh, it's, it's basically the same thing Niantic Titanic Titanic, you know the company likes the flop all right anyway that's enough enough jokes on my part you don't want to allow location because if you don't then the hacks not gonna work it doesn't seem like that would be the, this, the situation it seems like you want to hit deny but you do have to hit allow 
And uh, once you do that, you want to make sure your birthday is, uh, well, actually, I don't think it even matters, but, you know, just, just to play it safe, just in case they have a, an age rating, I would put 1901 as your birthday. It doesn't matter. You know, just me personally, I was born in the 1900s, uh, 1901 to be exact. Uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and hit uh, submit, and then you're going to sign in with your Google and your Pokemon Trainer account. As you can see right there, the hack is already loaded up and uh, has all the features that we had earlier. So uh, there we go. That's basically it. It's as simple as that. And uh, that's how you get this hack. So uh, yeah, it's actually that fucking simple. So just a reminder, Tutu app on your um, on a Safari if you have an iOS device or on your mobile browser for Android. Tutuapp.vip or tutuapp.com. Same thing brings you to this website. I'll have a link in the description below. Once you hit Tutu app, download the free version. You can do the VIP version if you want, but that's a waste of money. Do the free version unless you're Donald Trump. Download that shit. Once you open up Tutu app, bam, right there on the home screen, you have to scroll like a tiny bit. It's that Pokemon Go app right there. Install that bitch. And then, uh, obviously, there you go. You're fucking set. So if you enjoyed the video, be sure to smack a like on it. I do appreciate it. Also, I am doing a giveaway. I don't want to forget to mention. Um, so if you do want to win a gift card, be sure to smack a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Don't forget to subscribe now so you don't miss out on some updates on shit like this. And I uh, drop a comment. I'm going to pick a random comment that has done all those things to win the giveaway. So best of luck to you guys out there. Peace out, YouTube. Subscribe for more. Comment a hashtag Niantic is Titanic to show me you made it to the end of the video. And as always, Stay sexy, motherfuckers. Now let me tell you about my boy, FSU ATO. He got the swag that make all the fucking ladies yell. Every day he got the videos coming. All you other YouTubers, yeah, you better get to running. Get to running. He playing games for the people. For the people. Nah.